When you're effortlessly cruising through the streets of Portland, Oregon, or anywhere else for that matter, and you glance down at your dashboard, you'll see a bunch of dials and displays. One of them, often labeled as RPM, followed by X1000, is particularly noteworthy. But what does this arcane dashboard hieroglyph actually signify? Allow me to demystify this for you. RPM stands for revolutions per minute. It's a measure of how many times your car's engine completes a full rotation around its axis in one minute. Now the X1000 part is just as crucial to wrap your head around. You see, car engines are capable of spinning incredibly fast, and stating the RPM in thousands makes the number easier to digest. So when your car's RPM gauge reads two, it's not just lazily turning at two rotations per minute, it's whirling around at a whopping 2,000 rotations per minute. Understanding the RPM of your car is not just a matter of automotive trivia, it has practical applications. For example, knowing the RPM can help you drive more efficiently. Most cars have an RPM range where they operate the most efficiently, usually between the idle and the point where the engine seems to be working too hard, often around 2,500 to 3,000 revolutions per minute for many models. Keeping your engine running within this sweet spot can help you save fuel, especially on the open roads around the scenic landscapes surrounding Portland. Moreover, paying attention to your RPM can also give you insight into the right time to shift gears if you're driving a manual transmission car. Shift too early and your car might lug, too late, and you're wasting fuel and possibly stressing the engine unnecessarily. However, high RPMs are not inherently bad. When you need quick acceleration, like merging onto a freeway, your engine needs to work at a higher RPM level to provide that burst of power. Just be mindful not to push your engine into the red zone, which is aptly named for the red markings that typically begin around 6,000 to 7,000 revolutions per minute on many cars. Continuously operating your engine in this zone is akin to making it run a marathon without a water break. It's going to wear down much faster. So the next time you're driving and you sneak a peek at your dashboard, give a little nod of appreciation to that RPM gauge. It's not just another pretty face. It's a tool that, when used correctly, can enhance your driving experience, prolong the life of your car's engine, and even snag you a bit of extra cash on fuel savings. Now that's something to rev about.